Hello and welcome to WIT-AM, a daily look at world, national and regional news, sports, campus events and weather. I'm Kristen Barnes. The company says that 105 employees will be laid off at John Deere Dubuque Works. The announcement was made Friday and the layoffs will start in early April. A company spokesman blames current market conditions. The plant at Dubuque makes forestry and construction equipment, but not tractors. Three months ago, John Deere announced net sales were up 4% in the most recent quarter in construction and forestry products were reporting higher sales and net profit for the year. President Trump says there's been a great American comeback delivering his third State of the Union Tuesday. Trump said the nation is thriving and highly respected again. He said the time of the economic decay is over. Trump said the economy and the military are in the best shape ever. He noted that the state of the union is stronger than ever before. Standing in the House chamber where he was impeached in December, Trump did not shake the hand of the Democratic House Speaker Nancy Pelosi when, he extend, when she extended her hand. Disgraced former movie executive Harvey Weinstein will be back in New York courtroom today as his sex crimes trial resumes a day after the Academy Awards. The 67-year-old Weinstein is charged with five sex crimes, including rape and assault. His defense attorneys will continue presenting their case with witnesses they believe can persuade jurors. Weinstein isn't guilty. He insists any sexual activity with the women who accuse him was consensual. We'll be right back with a look at your WIT TV weather and entertainment news. Stay with us. Western Iowa Tech's Video and Media Production Program has been awarded an Upper Midwest Emmy Foundation 2019 Student Production Crystal Pillar Award. This award was presented by the National Academy of Television Arts and Sciences for Excellence in Production. Tune in to Siouxland's leading student-run newscast. It's the ideal place to stay informed with the latest in free activities for students and events happening on campus. Produced on campus in Western Iowa Tech's WIT TV studio. New episodes air every Friday afternoon on YouTube. Remember to subscribe and click the bell icon to get your weekly rundown for students, staff, and the community of Western Iowa Tech Community College. Welcome back. In entertainment news, the 92nd Annual Academy Awards is in the books. Korean drama Parasite was the big winner, taking home four Oscars, including Best Picture and Best Director. Jaqueline Phoenix won Best Actor in a Leading Role for his performance in Joker, and Renee Zellweger won Best Actress for playing Judy in Judy Garland in Judy. Laura Dern took home the award for Best Performance by an Actress in a Supporting Role, and Brad Pitt was the year's winner for Best Performance by an Actor in a Support Role for his work in Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Musical performances included an opening by Janelle Monae, Elton John, Cynthia Ervo, and Indina Menzel who was joined by several other singers from around the world who provide the singing voice of Elsa. Rapper Eminem performed his original song, Lose Yourself, and Billie Eilish sang The Beatles yesterday in tribute to the stars we lost this year. Toy Story 4 took home the award for this year's best animated feature film. The 92nd annual Oscars were held at the Dolby Theater in Hollywood and aired on ABC. Viewers are voicing out their disappointment after the Oscars left out Luke Perry in the Memor Memoram Tribute. The Ac Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences failed to include the late star in the tribute as Billie Eilish and Brother Phineas took the stage to perform yesterday by the Beatles. Fans have pointed out that the Disney Channel star Cameron Boyce was also skipped over. Taking a look at today's weather. Today will be sunny with a high of 39 degrees. Tonight, we'll be seeing partly cl cloudy skies and a low of 20 degrees. And tomorrow, we'll be, we'll be sunny and 37 degrees. Thanks for joining us. Be sure to check up on the latest WIT TV programming at our website and our YouTube page. See you tomorrow. <laughs>